Yo, what's going on? It's your boy Pat. Back with a video. So, this is what I'm gonna be doing. Um haven't decided if I'm gonna do three days or five days. Um what we're gonna be doing this watermelon fast. Nothing but watermelon and of course water for three or five days. Really don't know which one yet. Don't know. I'm gonna push for five. Push for the five. But we're gonna see. I do like watermelon, that's a plus. But eating it for that many times and days in a row is like, whew, we're gonna see. So, yep, I already got my first one right here. Pretty much devoured that. And then, of course, you know, I got my good water, you know, alkaline. Got to do that. So, we're gonna see how it's gonna go. I'll be back with an update. Show you what else I'm doing for this day, too. Yo, what's going on, y'all? This is definitely day two of the watermelon fast or watermelon flush, however you want to call it. Um, I just uh, worked out. Worked out about, we did like a 30 minute lift. Did around about two miles. Now I'm about to get some more watermelon, get a little low, and get some more water as well. And then, you know, eat my dinner. So. Um, feeling pretty good right now. Um, you know, I haven't had any, I mean, there's no symptoms of like, you know, sluggish or tiredness or anything. So I feel good. Um, so kind of just checking in and uh, I'm feeling. And, um, I actually haven't had a watermelon yet, but when I get home, I definitely will. It's about five o'clock here Casey so yeah kind of checking in on y'all um, I will not be doing a weigh-in until day five um, I'm just gonna wait until this just do a weigh-in I kind of already I mean I already know where I was before so that's that so yeah I'll be back soon So this is um, day four, it's about one o'clock. Um, I didn't check in with y'all yesterday. Yesterday was pretty busy, which is a good thing, as you know. Um, it was definitely um, a little harder. Um, had a little headache, wasn't too bad. Um, 
I mean, honestly, for the most part, um, I didn't really eat much watermelon. I think I had, I ate once yesterday. I'm so busy with um, work and then decided to go play some ball too. So I mean, I'm still staying active. Um, that's what I wanted to do. I wanted to still, that's, what the, that's the reason why I actually prefer to do watermelon over just water because of I can still, you know, work out or play some ball. Um, it still be cool. We're doing just the water fast is a little bit harder. So, but so far, like I said, I had a, a mild headache, which, you know, kind of went away. Um, <laughs> I will say I, um, you know, started to get those dreams again about food. It's like, oh man, here we go again. But we're still pushing. So it's day four. I'm going to keep going. I say I decided to do it between three to five, so it looks like I'm going to be going for the five day mark. Um, still have not did a weigh in, I refuse. I will be doing a weigh in tomorrow, yeah. I'll do a weigh in tomorrow, but um, I'm gonna give y'all some more updates today on what I'm doing. Make sure y'all, you know, because I'm planning on going to the gym, get a little lift session in, so I might show y'all what I'm doing today at the gym, but. I will be back. The work. 100 pound big bitches, let's go. Yeah, determination in that face. Yeah, that's the whole right. That's the whole right. That's 330 pounds. Huh? He different. That's it. Woo! Yep, so just came back from the gym. A real good lift session. Thought about doing cardio, but nah, I was too tired. Um, still feel good though. About to get in here, chop me up some watermelon. Drink me some more water. Probably call it a night. 7.30 right now. I was up late last night, so yeah, I'm probably gonna be early. And it don't help either that my, my wife got me Going around town, getting there, you know, food and stuff. Something that involves fries that I love. Ugh. Like, can't lie, man. Fries is definitely my weakness. But guess what? We're going to keep pushing, though. We don't eat none of that. Day four in the books. One more day. Um, like I said, I have no idea how much weight I lost. I am not, you know, on a scale. I would get on a scale uh, once day five is like completely over. So Saturday, which would be it'll be day six, but it'd be five days done. I'll do a weigh in Saturday morning, and. Uh, Hope for the best, man. This fast right here is definitely not for the week. Not gonna lie. Um, it's tough. But when you got goals and you got things you want to do, you just got to keep pushing. Mental focus is like 95% of this. It's all really just mental so if you got mental focus and i'm not addicted to food which i mean hell a lot of us like to eat i mean that's what we do but i'm gonna get it though 
um, at least one more day. Like I say, I, I did at first say three to five or past three. Technically, four is already done, so I got one more day to knock out and we do weigh ins, which I know a lot of y'all like, man, what's the weigh in? How much you weigh? Da, 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 da. I'm gonna tell y'all, be patient. Make sure you watch all the, the whole video and you're gonna see. I promise, I got you. All right, day four in the books. I'm out. Yo, what's up? He paired with an update. Uh, this is day five of the watermelon flush fast. I have completed. Uh, it's definitely been a journey. Uh, as you can see, I had I was actually um, working out and lifting and kind of doing a little cardio here and there uh, while doing fast. Um, will I do this again? Probably so. I can see myself doing it again. Um, I did lose a lot of weight. I know a lot of y'all want to see, you know, how much weight did he lose? Um, I was at 327, went down to 312. So about 15 pounds. So I'm about, you know, 13 pounds away from being back in the 200s. So yes, I'm definitely excited about that to get back in the 200s. Um, my goal is 220. So we are 92 pounds away from 220. So yes, I can't wait. Um, Day four was so hard. Like, I didn't get really any headaches yesterday. Headaches crazy. Um, energy was just a little low too. Real low energy yesterday. Um, I did still do a little lift. Um, but yeah, during the night hours, day four was brutal. Um, and then I just... It just seemed like everything was about food. I mean, turn on the TV, I kept seeing all the food commercials or just, you know, my wife wanted me to go get her some food. When I come back from the gym, I'm like, oh my goodness, it's killing me. But I did get through it. And like I say, um, we made it. Mama, we made it. Man, man, man. I um, actually think I might do a video talking about, cause I have done, you know, pretty sure you have seen it already. I've done a couple of water fasts as well. Um, so this is my first watermelon fast, which 90% of watermelon or 92%, whatever, is water. So you dang near is doing a water fast, but yeah. Um, it was really the hardest. Um, day one and two was pretty easy. Um, my main thing was, if, I were, if you were trying to do this, is try to stay busy as much as possible if that's you know reading books going for a light walk um driving around somewhere just try to play video games whatever you can do to keep your mind busy and focus off of not eating would definitely help because yeah that's how i got through most of my time um I wish I could just, you know, work, work out, sleep, but, you know, got family, so I can't really do that. That would make it a lot easier, but if you were, I would say this, if you were a single person out there and you want to do something like this and you're not really involved with anyone, like, and you are determined to do a little detox or cleanse, this would be for you because you can literally work, go to sleep, work, go to sleep, or... Like I said, if you want to do a little, little jog, do a light jog, like, life be, it's, it's a lot easier. But any of us are married folks out there or engaged folks or people that got relationships, it's definitely harder. Um, my wife's trying to get me to leave the house. It's like, I don't even, <laughs> I don't even want to leave the house when I'm on these fasts. Like, I just want to just sit still, to just no movement. I don't want to do nothing because I don't want to drop on no food. I don't want to see no food. Like, I don't want to think about no food. Like, man. But you got goals. You just got to you just keep remembering, like, all right, listen, no matter what, we got to get this detox going, um, cleanse my body. And also, I want to drop some pounds. 
So this definitely helped out both. Um, for a little bit, I feel like I was kind of eating. Um, so, I mean, I wouldn't say I don't really eat bad, bad. But, you know, I like carbs. <laughs> like, I'm a fried person. Fries and rice, like, that's kind of why I'm still vegan to this day. Because of fries and rice. Man. Whew. But nevertheless, I got to, you know, we're trying to cut, trying to lose weight, trying to detox. All that stuff got to go out the window. You got a bigger purpose. It's all about sacrificing. Sacrificing. Like, I have the rest of my life to eat whatever I want. And that's kind of how I take my approaches when I come to these facts. It's like, listen, we're doing this for a purpose. And we got next week. Like we got we we got years or days whatever it is to eat whatever we want, so just take this little bit of sacrifice for now, and the rewards will be better for you in the long run. Got goals, like I say. I mean, we had three twelve. We ain't stopping. Um, I think I will eat today. I might do. I might eat one meal today though. Just one meal. And I might go back and start another one tomorrow. If you want me to do this again for five more days, go in the comments below and type in five more days. Five more days if you want me to. But yeah, spam in the comments, five days. Or you can put up the hand five. Spam it if you want to see me do this for five more days and show y'all some more results. Help us out on the video. Like, comment, subscribe to the video. Um, what's to the channel? Um, right now we're on the road. We still want to get a thousand, but we're gonna go small. So we're on the road for 300. Right now we have to go at 209. So um, we're definitely gonna be posting more videos, not just videos like this, but we have other videos on the way. Um, like I said, we're trying to give you at least two videos a week. Um, I'm posting my stuff back on this channel about my weight loss and weight loss journey and transformations. That's going to be on this channel. So make sure y'all subscribe, like, and comment. And like I said, show this video to anybody that's out here wondering about, you know, doing some fast. Like I said, I got a five-day fast video that's on this channel. And now I got this five-day watermelon fast. Um, so, yeah, you can do, you know, either or. Um I really think if you are into working out or want to do more cardio, I think watermelon will be better. Uh, watermelon fast will be better for you just because you have a little bit more energy to do so. So I recommend doing watermelon instead of water if you want to work out. I know some people, I mean, even in my five day fast video, I did do some cardio. Um, so, I mean, it's all about your body and how your body responds. Um, some people can't work out during during doing fast. And if you can't, don't push yourself. Um, do what your body will allow you to do. Like you listen to your body. You know your body better than anybody else does. So, just make sure you take care of yourself while you are trying to do either fast. Um, like I say, I was just really determined. I mean, like I say, that I really, <laughs> really almost crashed day four, but I didn't. But, um, I'm gonna keep this video short. Mike, once again, if you want to see me do this again, like I said, I'm, I'm gonna eat today, but I'll start another one tomorrow. Spam in the comments five more days and give us. 15 likes to 15 to 20 likes and then give me about 20 comments five more days five more days and i'll do it all right i'm out of here y'all how's your boy